Hi, you're not going to believe this. Bloody Murphy gets me every time. I jinxed it. I just released last night uh, the water cooling solar panel video talking about my heat pump and, you know, answering a question on uh, Twitter about whether or not it's, you know, good to preheat the water for your water system using your solar panels. And practically at the same time, I released that video. I kid you not. At almost the exact time that my new heat pump uh, hot water system that I've got, I've done videos on, has been working flawlessly since it's been installed. But the exact time I released that video, look at what happened. This is last night. This is last night. I'll turn off the production graph. This is when I released the video, something like that. It started to oscillate. <laughs> my heat pump, my reclaim... My Aussie Reclaim heat pump, although it's not an Aussie heat pump, Re Reclaim, they, they're they the company, that strain company that make the uh, the stainless steel tank and everything else. But I believe it's a Japanese uh, heat pump. I can't remember Mitsubishi or somebody. I can't remember who actually makes the actual heat pump itself. But anyway, look, this is the power draw because I've got a current clamp just on the hot water system. And this is what the normal graph looks like. It just turns on at 10 a.m. And then, you know, a couple of hours later, depending on how, how much water it's used and the ambient temperature, it switches off. And then it, I've never seen this little wiggle in here. And then I've never seen this oscillation before. Unbelievable. It's, <laughs> the thing was bloody oscillating. And then I, I thought, oh, something weird's happening because I around about 8 p.m. or something, I, I actually changed the time because I was going to change the timer to shift this back. And then I, you know, I changed the timer and everything and it came on and I thought, oh, okay, it's, you know, it's going to reset itself or whatever. And I went back in to check it and this is what I got, this oscillation, unbelievable. And on top of that, bloody Murphy again, when I go to troubleshoot, I turned, I switch, <laughs> hello, IT, <laughs> you know, switch, have you tr tried switching the power off and on? Yeah, I, I switched the power off and on about 11 p.m. last night, okay? And then I went to check, and the data has, well, I went to check this morning, and my solar analytics system has failed. Look, this is live this morning. There's no data. I go out and check it. The LED 3 is flashing, which means that it's lost the 4G connection, which it did last week. I just complained about it last week. First time ever, it's just lost connection. And then a day later, it randomly came good. Just when I need, the exact time I need to actually troubleshoot an actual problem, my solar analytics system fails. Oh, bloody Murphy. Right, and then I can, right, I've got other monitoring systems. I've got the Enphase system, but unfortunately, like, this is last night, but it doesn't have the granularity in there, and it doesn't have, because we had air cons on last night, it was uh, cold. So, yeah, I can't see any oscillation in there. And I've got my, my energy zappy for my EV, and once again, this uh, orange one is the consumption. I can't see it in there because it doesn't have a specific current clamp only for the heat pump, which is what the solar and the system does. That's just the whole house consumption. So I can't, I can't see it in there. That's what my solar analytics for. It's got a specific current clamp for the heat pump, and it's bloody failed. Do you believe it? Do you like that? Is normal, right? That that is a normal thing, right? There it is. Turns on, and I can go. I went back through all my data. I've seen no history of oscillation whatsoever. Yet, last night, at the exact time that I released this video, video bragging about my heat pump hot water system, <laughs> it started oscillating. So anyway, um, OptoCoupler.io, who's one of my viewers on uh, X, um, he said that um, presumably he's got the same system. He said he's started doing the exact same thing last month and he just cycled the power and it came good. So I cycled the power this morning just before I came in, but I have no ability to monitor it whatsoever. Um, it had just, uh, it had just started uh, working, uh, this morning. It had just come on due to the timer thing. And uh, yeah, so I don't know. I'll get back to you. I'll leave a pinned comment down below. I, I just wanted to share with that. I just wanted to share that with you. That is <laughs> unbelievable. What are the odds? The exact same time I release the video, I get my first failure. <laughs> Bloody hell. That's my life. Anyway, leave it in the comments down below. Catch you next time.